Well, uh, talk about Compass 360, four of those very potent Honda Civics for them. And you guys talking about new driver pairings, Ryan Eversley and Zach Lutz in the 75 running well. Now, Lutz, another one of those drivers coming from the Mustang Challenge. And I talked to Carl Thompson, one of the principals at Compass 360, and I said, surprises me that he can drive this front wheel drive car so well. And he said, you know, the Mustang Challenge really is about carrying momentum and trying to conserve the car because it's a heavy car. And you really have to do the same thing here with this Civic. So even though it's front wheel drive, the theory behind the driving is all the same. Conserve, 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 and don't overdrive it. And that's why we're seeing a lot of these Mustang Challenge guys do so well. So not at all surprising to see the car run well because Compass 360 so strong. The championship winners last year in the SD class, but Zach Lutz right now having a great drive. There are actually 14 drivers in this uh, Continental Tire race today from that Mustang Challenge Series. So it's a good feeder class. And they're all doing well. And they're all doing well, yes. Look at the Compass 360 Hondas. Here they come, and they swoop right around the outside of Sarah Catanio. And the 77 of Donald Teach, who we haven't really seen a lot of today. Keep an eye out for him. The 74 is back in the mix. That's David Thelenius, who we saw start so well, qualify so well. And the orange machines, here they come. The <laughs> march forward. Sarah was a little outnumbered <laughs> back there. All she can see is orange. Well, we're used to seeing three Compass cars together. Remember, they, they had a president and swept the podium last year and immediately got 100 pounds added to the cars. <laughs> yeah. Talking to Carl Thompson, he said, we're still working with that. It really affects brake wear, tire wear. Not so much here at Daytona, but certainly when we get to the tight, twisty stuff, we're really hammering the brakes. We will have to conserve those. But still, the cars are really strong. I think they're really the performance bar in this ST class. Drama's here for one of our new...